Hello everybody and welcome to this new Minecraft series where I now have a webcam and I'm now just starting a new world on Minecraft Java Edition using some mods as well just to make the gameplay a bit better. No actual game enhancing mods, just visual. So as you can see in my hotbar I've got the bars numbered and I've got a rainbow XP bar and I've got optimise and a different um, hair crosshair that's pretty much the only difference there's a few other touches here and there just like breaking blocks it's got all of that but that's all you need to know really there's nothing game enhancing it's a totally legit survival world and it's just a visual mod so um i've just already got quite a bit of iron so now i am just going to wait for it to cook and i'll be back when that has happened the iron has now finally stopped smelting so I'm now just going to take myself and my belongings out of this cave. I've not seen the outside in a long time because I've been in that cave for a while now and it's not a very good site that I've come back to so I think I'm just gonna try and find somewhere to live and hopefully I can actually find a place that's going to have a lot of area because I'm planning to build quite a big house and I need a farm and everything else so I'll be back when I've found a lead to where I want to live. So we're now beginning to enter a new biome and the rain still hasn't passed. Oh, as I said that the new biome it is not raining so we're going to just go into here and we're going to get some coal in the ravine and then get back out and carry on looking for where to live. I am actually going to get some acacia wood because there is something really cool about these mods that I'd really like to show you to do with an acacia door. So I'll be using this on my house and I just want to show you exactly what it looks like. So I'll be back when I've got enough wood to actually make it. So this right here, for some reason it does look like this in the inventory but it doesn't when you place it down. But this is a 3D door, as you can see, it's actually got, the handle is, you know, sort of 3D and it's got a really nice touch to it. So, again, like I said, this gives no game enhancement, it just makes it look a lot better and for you guys, once I've actually built my house, it's going to look a lot nicer than it would on just a normal Minecraft world. So, I'm going to carry on looking for a um, village or somewhere to live. I can see there's some fire over there, but I'm not entirely sure why that is, so I'm going to go and find out. So the fire is literally just being caused by a small lava stream, nothing too serious. But I'm just going to have a look up here quickly. Uh, so, oh my god. Um, well, there's another big lava fall. But I do see right over here, there seems to be a jungle. Okay. I think, yeah. Okay, we've found a jungle. And a jungle is like my favourite biome. There's so many things in there. When it comes to animals, when it comes to, you know, opportunities opportunities to live there there's so many things that we could find in here so i'll be with you when i'm actually in the jungle so i've just entered the jungle and i have found this cave down here so i'm just gonna go and see what is in here other than the two zombies obviously but i want to see if there's anything worth getting in here because you never know there might be there's some coal so i'll definitely get the coal might as well pick that up whilst I'm here. So we have now got all of the coal we needed. And if we go straight through here. It seems to be quite a large cave. It's actually mixed with the outside. So as you can see there's grass on the floor in the cave. And we can come straight back out here. I think that might be the wise decision. Because from the looks of it there's nothing much in the cave. We just set the creeper off. Uh, um, okay, I'll, I'll take my words back. This is a giant cave. And I'm hoping that it goes down even further than this. So I could begin to get my... Yeah, I can see it does there. Just in that little gap down there, it actually goes further. So you can see there's lots of iron. Um, some coal down there. Okay, yeah, this cave's going to be worth getting into. So let's see. Just take the water stream down. 
already know that we're gonna get abused by some mobs. I just need to make a new stone pickaxe. So my shield and my new pickaxes are ready to go. I thought I'd put the bed in here as well, just in case I ended up dying, but I think I should be okay. So I'm just gonna mine some more iron and then hopefully we can find some diamonds in this cave. So I'm just gonna mine all of the ores I've seen so far and then I will be back. So I have actually found a new area in the cave where it does now get further down as you can see and it is actually turning into deeps like now and it seems to get a lot further down so I'm going to carry on adventuring down here and hopefully we can find something good down here. So actually I was correct there is something very good down here which is our first vein of diamonds. So there seems to be only two but I'm just going to check around because in the new update now it's not guaranteed that there is but it can be spread out slightly so i'm not sure if it's just vine chance where a vine can spawn next to a vine quite regularly or if it is sort of spread out but by the looks of it there isn't so we'll take the two for now and hopefully with the looks of this cave being very far down hopefully we can find some more so right here is our second vein of diamonds. So I'm feeling very confident about this cave. I'm hoping that we can get full diamond from it. But I'm not asking for too much because it is our first major cave that we've actually been into. So I'm just going to go down there really quickly. Let me just use some blocks because I don't want to fall all the way down. So if I just... can make my way across here and then yeah that was quite a bad idea but it's fine i'm not dead so that's all good so let's just get this that we need now and then we can carry on and hopefully find some more so yeah i told you the vines aren't always touching so as you can see with this one it was more of a diagonal so that looks like that's it for now so Oh, I see some more down here, but there are also four creepers. What, what is my luck? Okay, so if I can try and get them to not blow up the diamonds, that will be ideal. Okay. There's two zombies, four creepers. Mm -hmm. This is fair. If I can get him to blow up on them, that will be ideal for me. Turns out that's not going to happen. So... Most of them are dead now. Hopefully he doesn't see me. I just need to... Okay, yeah. Alright. That's the worry over. I mean, I can't moan. I'm getting XP, so that's all good. Okay, so there doesn't seem to be any more there. Oh, okay, so... Yeah, it's a zombie spawner. It didn't really surprise me. Alright, let's see what's in the chest. Um, it's like the iron. I don't really need anything else. Anything this way? No. Okay, so I'll be back with you when I find something else interesting because that's the end of the road for that direction. So I have not found anything else interesting other than a lot of mobs that are all trying to kill me. But other than that, um, nothing really. So... I do see over there though there is a massive open area of this cave so if, I, I just I don't want to fight any of these mobs but yeah I can see this is the giant part of the cave I'm not sure if we have already been here because I do remember once we got in here we saw the giant part but I'm not sure I think yeah this is what we could see from above but there is an abandoned mine shaft right there and see diamonds I see diamonds yeah just below okay so I need to just get up here really and then I'll be fine. So I've now made it up to the diamonds and actually if you look right down there there's some more as well. So once I've got these I'm going to go back down, get those and then if I don't see any more I'm going to explore the abandoned mine shaft. So I might as well do this in one so I can just fall down. I'm going to have to kill the zombies first. Once I've done that and get the diamonds and there's something else attacking me from behind yeah it's a baby zombie worst kind of zombie
That's so annoying. I can't hit it. Alright. Now we can finally get the diamonds. So let's just see how. Hopefully, it's going to be quite a big vein. I should, I should probably mine these out of the water. But let's see if there's anything below it. No. Okay. So another one vein. Right. Is there any? I'm just going to have a look around here. And I'll let you know if I find any more. This cave just doesn't seem to end. I think the title of this video is definitely going to have to link to this cave. Because this cave is giant. So once the spiders got off me, I need to go back up to there. Where the abandoned mine shaft is. And we can see if we can get anything out of the chest that we might need. Hopefully there's going to be. But it's not guaranteed that we're going to get anything too good. So we'll see. I feel like I'm now going to get lost in the mine shaft and I don't actually have my axe anymore so this is not a good thing and okay that's a quite a big drop down there what okay yeah we don't want to fall down there I can't actually place okay so yeah we're not gonna fall down there is there anything another giant drop and I think that is a dead end, except there is light coming from this way. If we go across here. Okay, well, that is pretty much the mine shaft. There's, it's not very big at all, and there's not much to see in here. We'll go back around the corner. I need to be wary because I don't actually have... I mean, I have a sword, but... When you're on Java, you really need to make the most of an axe as your best weapon, really. But we'll see. So, this guy needs to go. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I don't have any cooked food left either. So, I might need to cook some. So, there's light coming from this way. And I haven't actually been over here yet. So, it's that way as well. Um... So there's some iron there. Let's follow the tracks down here. More iron. I mean, what's up here? I just wish there was a chest. Okay, so there's nothing this way. I'm definitely going to need to cook some food. Now all of my food is cooked, I am ready to go. So let's see. If we go back this way. So... There was another entrance, if I remember rightly, yeah. Right down here to my right now. Okay. So, uh, some floating rails here, but there is things up there. So, well, if we just... Let's get up like this. So, rails. Nothing there. Um, is there anything this way? Can I actually walk on that? No, I can't. It's just glitched. Okay. Um, well, I can't. Right. Alright. Um, let's get my pickaxe back out. Some iron here. Um, oh, the, all of the rails are glitched. doesn't seem to oh there doesn't seem to be anything this way other than some ores in the ground but I don't really need any more iron is there anything oh there's some anything um let's build more lapis which i'll probably get in a second um yeah, I, I really don't think there's anything in this mine shaft at all. So, there is up here as well. Let's just build across. I don't really need any of the blocks in my inventory. 
and plus I haven't found a place to live yet so it's fine if I don't get out of the cave the way I came in because it's not like where I've got to go anywhere. Okay, well I'm just going to get myself out of this cave now because I don't want to get lost anymore and there's really nothing to find in here so let's just find one of the big drops. Okay, here it is. So first of all, if I just come over here don't want to fall down there I could fall here yeah probably not a good idea okay now I'm just gonna get myself out of this cave so I'm not really gonna do anything else other than build straight up so I'll be back when I'm finally out of here and back to freedom finally I've reached the outside of the cave so that's going to be the end of the first episode so thank you for watching and the second episode will be out soon where I'm most likely going to go back um, into a cave maybe not the same one because there wasn't really anything else in there and get some more diamonds to finally get some um, full diamond armour so see you in the next episode.